Now I need to download a font that I don't have on my PC already and the name of that font is American Captain. If you know the name of the font, you can search for it via Google or if you're looking for a specific font, you can go to a website that um, shows you that specific font or if you don't know what font you're looking for you can search for a font but i know what font i'm looking for the point is i know what font i'm looking for so i'm going to type in american captain font and i'm going to press search and usually the first link that um, shows up i select it so i'm going to select it and this font is from dafont.com now over here i see the download button and i'll download and it's going to ask me if i want to save i'm going to save that font now usually it goes to my download folder so i'm going to go to my download folder and here it is where i'm going to extract it by right clicking on the file and i'm going to select extract all and I'm going to extract now usually when it extracts the folder which it has been extracted into pops up so you're going to copy um, that by selecting the files you're going to right click you're going to hit copy and then we're going to go to local disk C we're going to go to program files and we're going to look for I think our system file folder uh, I do this all the time program files no we're going to go to windows and then we're going to look for our font folder we're going to right click and we're going to paste that baby in there usually when it's done pasting it notifies you and it says um, the American captain font is already installed I didn't know that I had it already but um, now that I have it already I'm still gonna replace it and I say okay yes I'm gonna replace it and then I'm gonna just close these folders and I'm using this in Photoshop so whatever program you're using it in I guess you can go and you can search to see if it's there and it's there so I select it and then I'm gonna type font and as you can see I have my font and that's how you save or download a font that isn't already on your PC to your PC. I hope this video was helpful. Please don't leave without subscribing, liking, sharing, or commenting on this video. I'll see you when I see you. Bye.